All right, so this is just a really quick overview of um, the digital archive of literacy narratives, which I've asked you to spend a little bit of time exploring on your own because I think it will give you um, more examples of what kinds of stories can be told about literacy, which will in turn help you to think about what kinds of stories or what story maybe really um, you will choose to talk about in your own literacy analysis. Um, so this is um, a research project that comes out of OSU, and um, it's a really uh, large archive. Um, some stories are video recorded, some are audio recorded, and some are text. Um, a lot of them come from um, actually um, researchers in the field of uh, literacy um, studies and um, college who study college writing and rhetoric. Um, and some of them come from people in the community, from kids, from high schoolers, you know, um, all kinds. Um, so there's a couple different ways to browse. You can do a quick search on any keyword. Um, so let's say you wanted to see uh, stories about music literacy. You might search music. Um, and we have 337 hits. So then maybe you'd want to get more specific with your keywords. Um, and the keywords are all provided by um, the contributors. Um, so that's the quick search option. Um, and we can see here, looks like there's actually some kind of visual included here. Yeah, this is a PDF. Um, so it looks like this is actually a visual um, narrative. And we can click it open, and then we see it. And it looks like there's some kind of poem here. Um, so you can take a look at that. Let's open one more entry just so you can see other examples. This one's called The Music and Me. This is a Word doc. So you'll always see the files included here. And sometimes there's more than one file included with one story. Um, you can also browse, and they give you several options. So let's say you're interested in seeing what people submitted you know, at a particular time, or you wanted to look through titles. Um, this is titles sorted alphabetically. Um, you could enter them differently, or you could go directly to one particular letter. But what I think might be most helpful is either subjects, which kind of um, is a list you could think of it as, of all the tags and keywords associated with the um, narratives here, or collections. So the collections are curated, so someone associated with the DALM has put these together. Um, and they have community literacy, um, deaf and hard, hard of hearing contributors. Um, they have all kinds of um, different themed collections you can look at. Um, so, you know, if I wanted to click undergraduate students of color, um, they have recent submissions on this page, but you can also click see all records and then you'll see everything that they kind of see fitting into that area. Okay, here I guess it's still six that they wanted to highlight. Um, but sometimes if you clicked CL records, you'd see even more. Um, so that is the DALN. I hope you have fun exploring.